let's explore the splice method. We'll use it to add and delete cars to this array. You can use the splice method to add and remove elements from an array. The syntax is straightforward. It's your array name dot splice method with two to three parameters. Index is the first parameter and it is required. It specifies the position of interest. How many is also required and this specifies how many elements to delete. Zero is an appropriate number to delete. The third parameter are the elements or specific values you want to add to your array. And you can have as many as you wish. The splice method is supported by all major web browsers. This code will splice or add items into our array. So the first thing I do is print a subtitle, cars added, and then I come into my splice. Now the name of the array is cars. So I've got cars dot slice. My index is two. I'm saying zero for how many. So zero will be deleted. And then beginning at position two, I add my elements, Corvette, and Z28. I then will write out the cars. Let's watch Splice add our two cars. And there they are. The Corvette is in the index 2 position, which is, because we count from 0, the third position, and Z28 comes next. Now let's use Splice to delete the fifth car from our array. And the line that does that is right here. Cars.splice. And our parameters are four and one. Begin at index number four, which is the fifth item in the list, and delete one. Here is our updated array. Trans Am, GTO, Corvette, Z28, Beetle, and Barracuda. We wanted to delete the fifth element from this array, which would be the beetle, and its index is four because we begin counting at zero. So let's see what happens when we run our JavaScript. The beetle is gone. Let's do both addition and deletion of elements from our cars array at the same time. So I come in and I'm doing a cars.splice and this time I'm using all three parameters. I'm saying beginning at position two, that'd be my second index or my third element in the array, delete three items and then add AMX. Here is our current array. The Beetle is gone, so we're left with Trans Am, GTO, Corvette, Z28, and Barracuda. Now, we were going to delete, beginning at the third element in the list, three items. So Corvette, Z28, and Barracuda will disappear. And in their place, we will add AMX. Let's give it a try. And there you go. It works. So what did we learn in this podcast? Well, I think we learned that it's very easy to add and delete data from arrays using Splice.